Hey guys, what up? It's Goose TV here again today, and today I'm back with another Mad Mobile video on my channel. Now, today's video, guys, we are back with another Ultimate Freeze video. We are talking about how to get Masters in this promo. The four Masters you see on the screen right now, we're going to be talking about how you can get them fast, kind of some strategies you can take to getting multiple of them if you want the pristine ice and things like that in this video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn my post notifications so you never miss any of my videos. 70% of you guys aren't subscribed, so please hit that subscribe subscribe button if you haven't already let's try to get this video to 150 likes i'm currently doing a holiday giveaway on my channel first thing be the first 10 people to comment on each video up until christmas and by then whoever has the most points will get a 25 dollars itunes or google play store gift card also join link in description to my discord we have a bunch of giveaways and things going on there so make sure to stay tuned but let's get right into the video ultimate freeze it's been a couple days so far about you know less than 48 hours because it was out at a you know eight o'clock on thursday night but it hasn't been bad so far i still don't agree completely with the math on these promos but we're still going we're still playing i'm still having fun grinding away on presents i'm getting presents so let me put that out there first for i know this is a master video but i'm going for presents um, personally, I think it's a lot more fun. I play this game for fun rather than grinding and competitively. I play this game for fun so I can make video videos for you guys and everything. And presents are absolutely what's better content for me for my channel. So I'm always going to go for presents in that sense. So, um, yeah, I'm going for presents, but masters are still an option for you. And a lot of people are what kind of what they're grinding for because the player selection is actually really really good so let's go over what you need for these 93 overall masters um and right now we have tim tebow sean taylor Randy moss and william perry i would probably expect a few more to be coming but i'm not exactly sure i know we're probably getting some men 50 players maybe tomorrow i'll try to make a video on that if that's coming um, but for example, Randy Moss, you need 30 of their specific player snowballs. Each player has a snowball of, for themselves. You need 15 82 plus Arctic players, and then you need one specific 89, 90, 91, and 92 player. Randy Moss is by far the most expensive of them all, so um, if you're going to go for him, I guess be wary of that, but yeah, he is definitely the most expensive. So let's go over what you need to get these specific items for each tier. The snowballs are pretty simple. In the events, this is really how you're getting all your snowballs. Or obviously in packs or whatever, but events are mainly how you're going to get your snowballs, and it's these events on the right, the blue and red snow fort. So the red one pertains to Taylor and Perry, so you're going to be getting snowballs from them in this event. And then for the blue one, it pertains to Tebow and Moss, so you're going to get those snowballs in those specific events. Obviously, you're going to want to play each one kind of at refresh. So basically, these events refresh at 10.30 a.m. and 10.30 p.m., so 12-hour resets, and you're going to get, I believe, a victory flag for your first win. You're you're going to want to play these at least each for the first win that's going to be the most important part of this um 40 stamina you'll have plenty of time to spam you know spam them throughout the day but you want to make sure you at least hit the first wins both times each day and that's because like i said you get those victory flags with those victory flags what you do is you trade in five of them for a snowball select and you can trade get 10 of any ultimate free snowball you can complete this set up to six times this is almost a once a day completion set because you can pretty much complete four of these events per day and get four per day of these victory flags. So uh, pretty much one per day. This should be super, super easy and you can get up to 60 snowballs literally just by playing those first wins. So I would highly recommend that you do this if you're going for masters and you want those snowballs. Either way, you know, just like me, I'm playing those for the ice to get the ice. But what you can do is you can trade those snowballs in for 82 plus players, which I can either sell or use on other promos. So next we need 50. 1582 pluses and there's a couple ways you can go about this if you're not going for presents and you're not using your cookies this is definitely the one to go for 100 cookies and one of each ornament or one of each snowball will get you an 82 plus player that is an option for you like i said if you're not going for presents that is definitely a way to spend your cookies on that and when you have leftover snowballs you can trade an eight of any snowball not specific ones to get an 82 plus player you need 15 of those a reminder if you didn't really complete much in cold fire mountain like i saved everything Look how many times I could complete this. I have 45k rock cell. I know this takes 1.25k. I still have a ton of items left. I'm trying to maybe get a master eventually, but I could get a ton of these 82 plus players. So make sure you don't have some leftover stuff because you might from this promo. So go back, see if you have any leftover stuff to complete these 82 plus sets for, for the ultimate freeze. And these sets are going to be up all month, so you can still go back and do those sets and utilize those other promos. It's really, really helpful. Other than that, we don't even need any of these 87s other than the point of getting these specific 89 pluses. So 
um, if you're not going to buy the 87 pluses then you're going to need to trade in some arctic players and more snowballs i would recommend you do your best to try to buy some of these 87 plus players because you're just using more snowballs at that point using more snowballs up that you could use to, on the masters or anything else or even getting these 89 plus players to get the 89 plus players this is a random player by the way there's 89s 90s 91 and 92 you need two 87 plus arctic which is once again expensive that's like 1.5 mil 1.4 mil depending on what you get them for and 20 snowballs which still not hard it's not super easy either you're gonna get yourself an 89 plus now the problem with an 89 plus is that it is not it's a, it's a random and mainly you're gonna get 89s but the thing is you need four different specific ones so really that leaves you with a couple options one of them is to do this set and trade in two more 87 pluses and two 89 pluses for one 89 plus or select so obviously you could select a 92 at that point but that is not worth it whatsoever you would be losing a lot of coins in that way so your best bet is to whatever you get sell it and then buy your specific player back that you want the price difference isn't super different different in between some of them like the 90s and like 91s and 92s go for about the same i know some of the 89s sell for about a million coins maybe a little bit more stuart 608 on reddit posted a full ultimate freeze free to play guide for this promo on how to get a master if you're completely free to play I will leave a link to this in the description below because it fully lays out exactly what you need, complete math wise, what you're going to need to spend to be able to get a master and everything like that. Your main limiting factor is going to be those snowballs, so chances are you're actually probably going to have to spend some gems to be able to get some more snowballs. It sucks, but we got a lot of gems from last promo with Black Friday, so if you have a lot of gems, I would recommend that you spend a little bit because like I said, chances are that you're going to need to spend a little bit if you're completely free to play to be able to get these masters if you're not spending a lot of gems. Um, on, uh, you know on stamina and things like that the problem is like I said um, unless you're spending a lot of gems they make these promos really really hard and it's really frustrating for a lot of people um, now the one thing that you know that can change that is if you have a lot of coins if you have a lot of coins you can bypass a lot of stuff because that means you're not gonna need really potentially to get any of these 89 so here's the other method you could do if your goal is literally just to get the pristine ice for these masters what you could do is get all the snowballs from the event super easy but buy everything else for these masters i say this with every single promo that's like this and it's 100 true what you can do buy get all the snowballs from the events that's going to be the easy part the hard part is getting all the snowballs for the other stuff but what you could do is buy all that other stuff on the auction house so for example i want to complete this sean taylor i get all the snowballs from the events i buy all the 15 uh 82 pluses and i buy each of the players specifically needed for the set then what i do is i complete that sean taylor set i get the pristine ice and i sell the sean taylor i sell the sean taylor for whatever he's going for eight nine mil or whatever and then what i do is i buy back for the next master let's say i want to complete randy moss next i buy then for the next master those items that i need but i still have the snowballs so you can keep going and get all that pristine ice for those masters you just keep selling keep selling now the problem is you might lose a few coins doing this method you might lose a couple million coins but the thing is you're getting that pristine ice which can help you get better players in the long run and then these cards will go down in price as the year progresses so once we get higher overall cards as even as time goes on right now they're more expensive than expensive than they'll be on christmas day so right now is probably the best time if you're going to do that to sell them and then buy them back later save yourself some coins is probably the smartest thing you can do so that's a method depending on what you want to do for these masters if you want to roster them for your team and you don't feel like spending coins you're going to have to spend some gems or at least spend a few coins to get a few players maybe not all of them but save yourself a little bit so you don't have to spend a ton of gems that's one of the ways you can do it one of the ways i would recommend doing it i might end up completing a master at some point but i would use coins if i'm going to do that at all even though you're completing masters, you can still get a few presents here and there. Make sure to complete the slope events. If you're getting the ice, you're still going to have to do some of these events every single day. There's a lot of things you can still do, but you're, you're probably trying to focus your stamina on the one thing. And hopefully we get some more escalation, some easier ways to be able to complete stuff later in this promo. Obviously, we're going to have more stuff for Christmas. So one thing I would recommend to you is don't do everything right away. Save as much as you can because you might see something later in the promo that you like a little bit more. We're not exactly sure what yet. There might be NFL 50 players coming out tomorrow man 50 players coming out tomorrow we're not exactly sure but that's just about it today's post notification shout out goes out to tenzin be the first person to comment on the video for the next video's post notification shout out but anyways guys that is just about it for the video i hope you guys did enjoy it if you did make sure to like it and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i'm goose tv and i'm out i will see you guys later